Party Dog Christmas Show has been brought to you by Bud Light, the light beer with the first name and taste, and the official beer of the Playa Vista Party Dog. Remember to ask for Bud Light, because anything else is just a light. And I your bus, St. Louis, Missouri. You know, friends, I still find it hard to believe that Anisha Bush is going to be owned by a foreigner, a Belgian-Brazilian brewer called InBev. The deal has already taken place. Anisha Bush and InBev have already approved the merger. And it's you know, throughout 2009, you're going to see a big difference in Anisha Bush InBev. We've already seen the logo. And the famous uh, Anheuser Busch bird has been replaced by this flying bird. It's, looks like a <laughs> looks like it's running away from anything and everything, like a chicken. Well, that's I guess that's life in the in the era of big of uh, government taking over everything, including the banks and including finances as we are now in the Great Depression of 2008. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the end of the line. The Play of Mr. Party Dog show is over, and it's with a lot of regret that we're going to be ending this program. But the reality is very simple. We did eight segments tonight. It is, to put it mildly, an event we did tonight at probably is lunacy. But we sure had a good time doing all these segments for you right here on the Harbor 2008 channel only on YouTube. And I got a lot of people I want to thank. Um, the idea of this show came from a show on E! on the radio division of E! Entertainment Television. It's called the Hollywood Party Girl Show. Hosted by Christina Gibson. Um, at the time I first heard the show, uh, one of my top friends on MySpace, now one of my top friends also on Facebook, and a lady we featured in our last show, Amy Paffrath, was co-hosting the show with Christina Gibson. And I had so much fun listening to Amy tell the stories of <laughs> um, her time in Los Angeles and Especially the, the uh, story about the, the grotto at the Playboy Mansion, the, the hot tub, and what was going on in there when they had the Candyland um, night that she attended. Oh, that was funny. I mean, all these people running around in the tub, totally nude, <laughs> and doing the wild thing in there. Oh, <laughs> poor Amy. You come from the Midwest, you come out here to wild and crazy Los Angeles, I don't think she realized what was going on. That's the tub where Magic Johnson had some of his wildest parties. And you wonder how he got the HIV virus? From being in the grotto, in the hot tub at the grotto at the Playboy Mansion. That's how he got it, believe it or not. Um, but that's where I got the idea for the show, was sort of from the Hollywood Party Girl radio show. And um, a, a show, there's a pilot going on right now. Christina Gibson is doing a pilot for a Hollywood Party Girl TV show. And um, I hope it, it will be on E! very soon in 2009. I'd love to see that. Uh, I'm not a party person, so I want to see what everybody else does at the party scene in Hollywood. And I found out today that Amy Paffrath is uh, involved with a pilot with, with Ken Baker, the executive editor of E! News, and I'm very happy, I hope it, and they think they've got a good chance of that also being on the air in 2009. I, that would be really great for both of these shows to be on E! Entertainment Television in 2009, because um, they have a lot of good stuff on there, and this would certain and uh, people like Christina Gibson and Amy Paffrath would add to the, the quality um, news and information that you see on E! Entertainment Television. Uh, entertainment news is now mainstream, and uh, 
E has certainly played a part in that. And good luck to uh, Christine and Amy. I hope they get your shows on the air in 2009. Um, two of my biggest fans here on YouTube are Michelle Campbell of uh, Christchurch Canterbury, New Zealand, who we featured with Amy in July when we celebrated our birthdays, and a lady from Papano Beach, Florida, by the name of Kathleen Atkins, better known as Caddy. They are my two biggest fans here of the Playa Vista Party Dog Show, and um, they're also, um, they also contact me on IM, on MySpace, and now on, hopefully on, on Facebook, and to, um, ca and to um, Shells and the Caddy, thank you for your support, thank you for your friendship, you've helped me an awful lot. Um, I wish I had a cupcake here as well. I picked up a new friend that I want to talk about as well. Um, Brittany Taylor. I just picked up recently as a um, MySpace friend and also just picked her up as a YouTube friend and a Facebook friend. Uh, she's one of the funniest people on YouTube. She has a new video will be coming out December 4th and another one I believe coming out next the following week. And... Um, if you have never um, seen her, she has an alter ego, so to speak. This alter ego is named Rhonda Anthony Tanner, life coach. In fact, if you've heard the opening, it's really funny. This is Rhonda. Rhonda Anthony. Rhonda Anthony Tanner. Right coaching. We exterminate the pests out of your life. <laughs> She also, uh, Brittany also has an inner alien as part of the Rhonda Anthony Tanner character by the name of Muffy. <laughs> and she has a weakness for cupcakes. Gee, maybe I should rush in the kitchen because I have a weakness for chocolate muffins. <laughs> but I hope you get a chance to see her on um, YouTube and make sure you click up as a friend on both MySpace and on Facebook because... Uh, She's a very funny person, and she now has a million uh, hits on, of all of her videos on YouTube. I'll be lucky if I get 2,000 hits eventually. Well, I, well, I'll take that back. I'm getting close to 2,000. I'll be lucky if I get 10,000 hits. And after this show is over, I'll be lucky if I get any more hits on YouTube. <laughs> so hopefully that won't be the case. But... Um, if you're wondering what's going to happen with the Harbor 2008 channel in the future, we're kind of going more to one-shot things, more than likely. You might see me put a video up there. You may see me do a recorded program that I really liked and I thought it would be fun to put on the channel. You might see me do, um, oh gosh, um, might come back here if you did in the last segment and talk politics, talk sports, you know, whatever you want. Uh, going to go back to the time we did the, um, the little dance we out here, <laughs> Dancing with the Stiff. That kind of started the Harbor 2008 channel on its way, and um, I have several videos now that have had over 500 views. Unfortunately for this program, we're not getting a lot of views, and that's why we're not going to cut the program out after tonight. But before we go... We've mentioned the number of people. I also want to thank all of you who have watched the Play of Vista Party Dog Show in our various segments throughout 2008. I hope you'll stay with the Harbor 2008 channel in 2009. We'll have a lot of interesting stuff coming up on it. Uh, maybe we'll do some interviews. Maybe we'll just, you know, do something, things differently than we've done here in 2008. Because, frankly, I just don't have the time to do eight-segment shows anymore. I just don't. Granted, I'm out of work right now, and I have the time to do this. But I want to be working next year, hopefully. And if things get any worse, that's why I may want to start taking classes and doing TV commercials, because if I, if I can do that, maybe I'll get lucky and get noticed on, on a video and maybe wind up doing television commercials eventually. Because this economy is going to be crap, I've got a feeling, for the next at least year and maybe more. I hope not. But I'm afraid that's where we're headed. So, for the final time, this is John Harbour saying thank you for watching. 
the Playa Vista Party Dog Christmas Show, right here on the Harbor 2008 channel, only on YouTube. To our Jewish friends, Happy Hanukkah, and to the rest of you, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, Season's Greetings. We'll talk to you in 2009. Till then, good night, everybody, and thank you.